Hey guys, welcome to my channel. I'm Jess. I'm going to be doing a tag video today. Um, it was started by a YouTuber called Liz Hurling and she is a pretty new YouTuber so I was really excited to discover her because I saw a few other YouTubers doing this tag as well and it is um, one luxury bag per season tag. So basically you have to choose one bag uh, in your collection that's appropriate for a season of the year which I think is pretty hard because I have a lot of bags and well I don't know I kind of hard to choose just one um, so anyway if you like handbags and stuff please like and subscribe to my channel I would super appreciate it and I'm super trying to get to 1k subs so make my dream come true thank you <laughs> anyway so I live in Melbourne so a lot of people in Australia it's like hot 24-7 but where I live it's actually pretty cold most of the time so a lot of my kind of fashion choices are definitely based around that so I have a large collection of coats and boots and obviously then my bags have to kind of you know match so I actually tend to wear a lot of like summer colored bags in winter anyway like I have a lot of kind of bright colors but I still think they kind of work especially if you you know Melbourne fashion especially a lot of people are known to be just wearing full black all the time and very neutral colors um, so I do do that sometimes but I like to wear fun accessories so I would say most of my bags I wear all year round but they're yeah, there are probably a few I wear more in you know a particular season so first I'm going to start with winter and I have my little Shirling Toy Lulu. Uh, this I definitely wear just when I'm wearing a coat or something or if it's a really cold day so I would make this the winter bag purely because of the material it's like yeah sheep so it definitely has that winter vibe and it goes with a lot of my fluffy coats and that sort of thing I think in summer it's I mean you could wear it but it just doesn't really it looks like a cozy warm kind of style so it would definitely suit colder weather and yeah if I move to Queensland or something guys like I think a lot of my wardrobe would just be redundant because I have so many coats and like yeah like boots and things it would just yeah so um, yeah I kind of feel bad for people who live in hot climates because I feel like your fashion choices are like you just have to wear like shorts and dresses and stuff all the time and like sandals like and I definitely prefer winter fashion myself but I actually prefer summer weather so anyway so if I want to move to Queensland then a lot of these things I probably won't need anymore but for winter yeah I think this is probably a bag that is more wintry than most of my other bags and then a summer bag now this is hard because I feel like a lot of these kind of colors are summery but I still wear them all year round but um what will I mean the Escal colorway I think is very summery I used to have an Escal um you would I don't know you guys may have seen on my channel I had a Neo Noe in this print and because I'm always wearing coats and stuff I just felt like it's it's very summery especially this color scheme so yeah something like this I'd probably wear more in the summertime these kinds of colors and I guess yeah maybe something like the yellow classic flap I mean this is so cute with like a little floral dress or something let me see if I can find something this is something I just pulled out but this is something I would only wear in summer so yeah something like this I would wear together I know it's a lot of color but I think that's just super vibrant but then at the same time I would still wear this in winter as well with like kind of like the combination of like tan with this yellow as well so even though I would wear this all year round this definitely I think goes with a lot of like summer looks just because of the the fresh color so yeah that's I'm gonna make that the summer bag now the autumn bag or fall bag so that's a bit of a like a trans seasonal style hmm you know I feel like all the monogram Louis Vuitton bags are also just all year round I don't know I feel like monogram it's just it's hard to choose a, a Louis Vuitton bag for a season but then I kind of feel like the reverse 
this just feels more autumny to me, I think, because it's more of that beigey neutral colour. So, yeah, I'd probably choose this for the autumn bag. I think the little bucket, it just reminds me of, like, I could just imagine, like, kicking my my legs in the leaves with this bag and being like, wee! Like, I don't know. This just gives me autumn vibes, I think. This is what I would choose as the autumn bag. And then, what's left? Spring. So, you know... The flowers are blooming, it's starting to get into summer, I'm feeling great, so maybe I want a brighter bag. So maybe for spring, I'm going to go, um, I'm going to choose the Picatin because I think it's really fresh and, you know, I, I can just imagine you know, going through a tulip field with this bag or something, you know, spring, fresh air. And yeah, I think this is a nice spring bag, but maybe I would also choose, like, the, the cherry speedy, because I feel like, you know, the fresh fruit is starting to come in season, and this also gives me a bit of a spring fresh vibe, so... But, you know, all these bags I do, do wear all year round, apart from the, the fluffy one. I think that's just very winter so but anyway that's 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 that so anyway I wanted to show you guys also um like stuff I've been buying lately because I thought it would be fun to share and because I'm like a shopaholic I'm just like constantly shopping so let me show you what I bought on eBay I have to ban myself from eBay because it is so addictive but I'm just really good at it so I found a Burberry trench coat this I literally paid, I think, $300 Australian for, and it's just, it's really cool. It has, it's from the collection with the rainbow, and I really like the rainbow interior of this, um, and it's just a classic trench, you know, probably never go out of style. I don't know if I'm going to wear it anytime soon, but I just had to grab it because it was an auction, and not many people had bid on it, and... I won. I, I won the auction. So, loving it. So, let me show you guys what it looks like because may as well. It's actually like probably one or two sizes bigger than what I usually get, but it actually I think still looks cool. So, just a classic trench there. It, oh, whoa. I don't know if you guys can see this. This is just a great layering piece. It's just a neutral color, so it goes with everything. I can imagine it with like something like this. What about it? Yeah, this is such an awesome outfit, right, guys? <laughs> so, yes. And I also bought on ASOS. ASOS keep having like extra 20% off, blah, blah, blah. And yeah, I got sucked in and I bought these um, sock boots. I really wanted some like pointy sock boots for a while and they're from the brand Senso so that's actually an Australian brand and they had them on the Senso website but they like sold out or something I was like stalking it and then these were on like double discount so I bought it and I really like sock boots with like kick flare jeans and stuff I just think it looks really it makes your leg look really slim I think with like a black pant if you can see this guys whoa <laughs> so it's like that yeah it just makes you it, I don't know it's just like a cute style I kind of like it so that's that and then I also bought um there's like a shop in Australia called Inku and they were having extra 20% off sale and I bought this little sweatshirt jumper because I I kind of was on in the market for another like sweatshirt top but I wanted like a cute one so this is a Mason Kitsumi Kitsune top um and I really like this brand because I went to the cafe when I went to Japan and it was really good the matcha latte was so yum and I just think they do really good t-shirts and really comfy just uh, casual wear so I got this and I really like the color scheme and I think it will look really cute with a little mini speedy. I just think that's a really cute rainbow outfit. So that's what I got recently. Um, but yeah, um, I tag everyone who wants to do this video. Um, Albie Lux Girl, Bits and Bags, uh, Malka Lux, Yoshia Lux, and Winnie B LV, 
and um, Sam, and if I forgot you, um, just, just do it, okay? So, um, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye!